Chat beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. Happy Wednesday. Hope you guys had a fabulous week. Today we are going to be making like a junk journal belly band, which again can be used as a bookmark or a little page stamp. You guys can use it as you pleased. I have used a, a similar dice when we did the uh, film strips project, but keep watching guys and I will see you very soon. Okay guys, welcome back on the desk. Happy Wednesday. Oh guys, I've been to the gym this morning and I'm a bit tired. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm going to stop to have um, either a cup of tea or decaf coffee. I don't know, am I going to have a cup of tea in a minute? Um, so yeah, I just go back from the gym. At some point, uh, Jamie is going to call me. So I had to pause the video because he's on his lunch break. And um, he said, I'll call you after that eating. Um, so, yeah, he calls me on his lunch break. So, at some point, I have to post the video and pick up his call. Talking about Jamie, I just want to say thank you. Uh, you probably saw me a post I shared on Facebook, on our Facebook group a couple of days ago uh, with Jamie's um, business page. And I have lots of pr private questions and emails. Uh, first of all, thank you so much for showing Jamie some support. Yeah, so Jamie is a millionaire designer. Uh, he does that part-time and part-time he works as well. Uh, he's a retail manager like myself. Um, so he basically designed these big hats. They're more like sculptural hats, more like artistic hats uh, in the past. He's worked with Selfridges. He had a couple of a uh, couple of years the Christmas window. They um, basically work on commission as well. So brands. Um, he worked with some um, famous artists, the Paloma Faith, uh, Roland Mavula, um, Beyonce. Did quite a lot of collaboration. Um, they basically they stylist request some specific hats, and Jay makes them and ship them away. So that's how it works. But he also does like bridal. Um, all different sort of like hats and things so yeah so yeah that's what jamie does um so yes thank yous for showing in support and in case you missed it i will put jamie's facebook page link in the info box so if you guys can show support he <laughs> he will be absolutely delighted bless him he was so excited when um it's all your comments on his page so um yes thank you <laughs> from both of us but mostly from me from his point as well but of course from me so today, uh, oh, big news, guys. Uh, I just messaged my uncle this morning. My uncle is a severe, I'm sure it's pronounced like that, severe, something like that. Um, so he's basically taking care of the project for our house in Italy. So he texted me this morning saying that they're having a meeting today. So... I said to him to call me straight back after. Uh, in this meeting, they finalise if um, the house uh, is 100% um, safe and also legal to be purchased uh, so we can put an offer on. Because originally, when we went to see the house, this house had additional rooms that during the 80s were built without planning permission. So the owner had to demolish the two rooms and make sure that the house that we are buying matches the floor, the original floor plan. Uh, because, of course, during the 80s, everybody was doing work in the houses um, without planning permission because they thought that the house would be passed into the generation and stay in the family. Of course, things have changed and now people selling houses. But, of course, if you want to buy them, good luck. Because a lot of houses got illegal, I call them things. So, yeah, it's a big... Um, big news i'm really really excited i'm hoping if he thinks that uh, we should be able to put an offer on and buy the house but i don't want to be too optimistic uh but I, inside myself i'm very optimistic but i don't want to tempt fate. four minutes and uh, four seconds and i have not done anything so apologies so let's crack on today i want to be playing and i want to showcase for the last time uh, yes because as i said august all my 99p um, digital papers will disappear from the website because i am working on the new papers so the old ones i'm gonna go some of will stay 
but the uh the old ones are gonna go because i'm doing a bit revamp um i have some ideas with this same similar papers that I want to do different kits so there's no point to have similar kits they look quite yeah sorry similar again so that was similar twice but there is no point to have similar kits so um i have different ideas and things that i want to do so i'm discontinue on a 99p uh sale i think it's like 10 or 12 i think it's even more i will put the link on the on the info box if you guys want to go and purchase them because they will disappeared on the 31st of august we're gonna say goodbye so yes so today we're gonna play with the uh, it's called adventurous traveler and this kit is designed for like a travel journal it's full of maps roads etc etc so we this is the biggest kit it's the second biggest kit it's got 18 pages and I'm going to show you really, like, really, really quickly. Um, so you've got lots of background. And, of course, it wouldn't be me without some flowers. So you still got your road, <laughs> your road maps. But I have to put some flowers because, yeah, it's me. <laughs> got UK, we got India, Europe, uh, Europe, America. Europe again with some blue flowers and some yellow dots. Some more with flowers. It's basically a lot of these are collages. Oh yes. So right, pen. I need a pen or the pencil and I can't locate any any nearby. So get this pen. So this is Italy. Okay. My region is this one here. That. This is my region and my home village is literally there on the very bottom south there on the bottom tip 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 of italy so there's albania here and there's africa there which is the beginning so this is why it's always very hot so that's where i'm from <laughs> little um <laughs> yeah something to show to share with you guys i'll keep that last um then you've got envelopes got tons of envelopes so what you do you fold that 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 and that and that is the top of your envelope so you've got tons all with this collage with the maps and flowers and stamps so everything if you want to do like a journal and the reason why i put pockets in this kit is because i'm thinking if you want to document a trip or a travel you want to store little ephemera little tickets you've got the envelopes for it so there's tons of envelopes and then you've got cup, uh, one page, I think. Yeah, one page with the tags. And then one page with... Um, why I can... Is it just one? No, I think it's two. Yeah, two. Uh, one page with uh, tags, like travel tags. With all different parts, which I'm going to use it today. And you've got one page with the pockets. So you've got two square... Uh, sorry, side pockets and the ephemera pockets and then you got a pillow box like a little gift box with some flowers embellishment now this page here on monday i have shown you how to use them in a journal so this page here is basically this one so you basically cut these little pockets glue down the tabs and you get a 3d pockets which is like this and then you slide your ephemera inside okay so what i thought we're doing today we're going to make some belly bands or like bookmarks so and i'm not going to show you them on camera guys because literally it's just a collage <laughs> um i'm going to collage i might do like a speedy up video so you saw me like how to make well not how to make it but you saw you basically see the process but i don't want to make these videos too long because i i know you guys love long videos but i don't <laughs> um i just think like you guys of course watch my videos and you watch other 20 other creators videos and um, i value your time and i'm I'm conscious that you don't want to be sat on your sofa on your couch watching my video for half an hour somebody else for half an hour somebody else for half an hour and your day is gone so and i always want to my video to just be quite compact so give you some ideas so you get up your sofa <laughs> and go and make them no i'm joking but uh, yeah it is there is no point so it, it's basically a collage the belly bands 
are intended to be strips that you this is the journal we made on monday in case you missed i will put a link down below um very very simple it's like a threefold um we put some pockets some pockets there there is another pocket here and then on the back i put two envelopes another ephemera pocket there and that is the front so the belly bands are basically strips that you glue to your journal on the top and the bottom and um you use them to it's like bands really to put your documents or ephemera but also can be used as a bookmarks it's up to you what i thought would do because this paper are quite vintagey i'm going to use um my um Preacher's Photos Digital Kit. Uh, now, this is the biggest kit I have ever designed. I think it's got 25 pages. And this, this page, these photos here are original Italian photos from my home village. I have asked permission to, um, oh, brilliant. My neighbors is cutting the grass. So apologies about the noise on the background. Um, so it's basically a collection of, um, different sizes. Um, photos from my home village uh, they're all original they're all authentic and they going from the 1940s into no sorry from the 1920 to the 1960 this is my uh, this is the sea of my home village this is the uh, an ice cream guy the very first ice cream people uh, they're all different sizes this is my main square is basically what i wanted to do with this kit is giving you a piece of my home village to you guys uh, there are some women working the tobacco leaves which was very popular during the 1950s um again more and these photos are all different sizes and uh, don't look at that that can go in because it got some uh, mistake on the printout so you it's huge very huge and yeah these kits is just basically part of my history and what i am so that's why i'm personally attached to this to these photos um and i thought it would be nice to share it with you guys so what am i gonna do guys simply gonna do collages okay master boards and cut them into strips simple as and i'm going to use this as a background so nothing like so over sophisticated nothing over the top I'm literally going to cut some of these and I'm going to use the background, uh, maybe this page here because I printed on a cardstock, you probably feel it, um, and I use that um, as a base and cut the strips, okay? Okay, so the collage is done and I didn't over cover it because I still wanted to see the background with the map. And when I was choosing which images from the photo kit I would put, I deliberately not chosen anything with faces because I'm going to cut it now and I don't want like the belly band to have like half of the face cut off so i picked generic pictures that even if we cut it in a half will still make sense um i use all the tags from the kit even the little one it says paris we got airmail we've got jakarta istanbul so yeah it got um you've got loads of it now originally i was thinking to do a tall belly band but now I'm thinking when I was gluing it, I actually prefer smaller belly band. I don't want to be dictated on how I cut my collage. I mean, you can do it if you want, but I'm going to um, turn it over. So nobody's, I'm not like conditioned, not conditioned. I'm not um, 
it's this picture's not telling me what to cut so it's going to be completely random so i thought we'd do two inches is it going to be too small no do two inches just go with the flow guys go with the flow don't worry too much it's gonna be a surprise yeah the last is a little bit but i'm sure we can um, do something with that so let's have a look belly band number one Oh, it's so cool, actually. I'm really pleased. Number two. Oh, I'm, I'm, do you know, guys, I was gluing fragile down. I was like, oh, my God, I hope I'm, it don't get chop, chopped. But literally, luckily, it's fragile, still intact. I mean, some of the tags have been chopped off, but you, luckily, none of the pictures have. But, um, yeah, I think they're fabulous. You can use them with bookmarks or you can use them as um, belly band. So what you would do, so for example, if this is your journal, you would glue the top and the bottom and you slice, you know, you can slide anything in like pages and things like that. So it works as a, as a band. That's, the, that's, that's why it's called belly band. So what I'm gonna do, um, I'm just going to ink it. Okay, just gonna use if I find them under there. My distress inks, and um, they're just gonna ink all the edges because I want it to be. Uh, I want them to to have like a little vintagey look. Even the little one is quite is quite cute. Um, so this is this is the uh, we've done a video a couple of ooh, more than a couple of weeks ago, mostly a couple of months ago. Uh, I played with these. Um, I got from eBay and we made this for vintage uh, film strips uh, so you can do the same so what I was thinking as well um, you and I got some lace here left over on, on the desk so if you want to decorate this belly band you can go you can put some lace on the back and make it even more vintagey you can add decoration on top um, but mine I want mine to be quite simple but um, that's another idea what you can do either you can put it some craft cardstock on the back okay and put that put the lace on top you can either cut it a bit smaller if you want or you can just leave it like what i've just done literally leave them as a um, as a as, as a strips which is that's what they are um okay so let me uh let me distress and i'll be right back okay so that's a close up of the five belly band uh, with the edged inked uh, quite quite fun I, quite, I really enjoy making this i mean you can make you could probably get six of one sheet if you make it slightly shorter but uh, yeah completely completely up to you they can either be the size of those if um if you wanted to so yeah guys i hope you guys uh like this little it's not tutorial just a little project um to give you some hopefully some ideas and inspiration if you want to get the traveler um kit i will link it in the info box uh, as a reminder all my 99 people disappear on the 31st of august so if you guys want to have a look around and shop for you please feel free to do so guys a big shout out special shout out today goes to the lovely bev wilson and i will put bev's comment on the screen now bev always taking the time to leave wonderful um and sweet and kind comments on my video so today uh bev the shout out is for you and bev in a comment said that she loved my film strips which uh, those ones and actually bev uh, on your comment i took inspiration from your comment to make this video because I wanted to create something different what, um, with this sort of um, shape that the wedding film strip. So I came up with these belly band ideas. I hope you guys enjoy them. And if you make them, don't forget to share them off my Facebook group. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please, please give a really big thumbs up. It really helps with the growth here on YouTube. I will put a couple of links here on the screen if you guys 
please feel free to keep watching. One when we made the uh, four vintage film strips and another video when um, we made some more lace corner bookmark. Again, if you like a bookmark, that's the video for you. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching once again. And until Friday, stay safe and well. Mwah. Bye.